Prince Harry and Prince William did not speak for two months after announcing Roy is it. Prince Harry and Prince William did not speak to each other for around two months after Susie says around they could step down as senior royals, an expert has claimed. Oh Scobie, author of the new biography about Prince Harry and Meghan Markle titled Fighting Freedom, will reveal the news today in a television interview, according to The Sun. The interview will be aired on To Royalty TV with presenter Kane Thornton. Mr. Scobie asks even now, the two dukes hardly speak following disagreements. The royal experts say Prince William was upset with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex for posting their estate plan on Instagram, damaging the royal family's reputation. The two brothers' co-relations were reportedly caused by what has been called the Sandringham Summit. This is the occasion on which senior royals plan out how Meghan and Harry could step down. However, there was also speculation of tension between the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge before this. Mr. Scobie said the two brothers' relations are really going to take some time to heal. He added the public nature of the announcement caused hurt to Prince William because he's not just a brother, he's also a pure king. The lack of communication between the Sussexes and the Cambridges also involves Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton. Multiple sources have reportedly told the Sun that the two duchesses don't communicate personally at all. The two dukes, on the other hand, do not speak very much. However, Mr. Scobie has said the relationship between Meghan and Kate really never would get that far in the first place. Indeed, according to the excess of fighting freedom, the two to the duchesses struggle to move past the distance politeness of the first meeting. One royal expert, Duncan Lacombe, has said the book might help clear the air between the two royal couples. He added, It would be nice to think they could bury the hatred now, but I don't think many people think that's going to happen. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have said they did not contribute to the biography. Similarly, Mr. Scobie has tweeted to clarify he did not have lengthy interviews with his couple, but rather a few words at engagements. He added, The amount of nonsense doing the rounds thing right now is unreal. Instead, we reportedly involved its authors Mr. Scobie and Carolyn Durant speaking with over 100 sources. Harry and Meghan moved to the US around the same time they officially stepped down as senior royals in March this year. The couple initially lived in Los Angeles, though recent reports claim that they have now moved to an $11 million home in the Santa Barbara area of California.